In this video, we'll cover the basics of exploring fractals in Fractal Extreme, or FX. We start by creating a new fractal document. In addition to the classic Mandelbrot set, there are variations with slightly different formulae and variations with completely different fractal types, such as the Newton and the Nova fractals. For today, let's just look at the classic Mandelbrot set. FX initially displays the Mandelbrot set at zero magnification. Fractal exploration is when you zoom in on interesting areas. You can go to the location menu and select zoom in, but the trouble with that is it zooms in around the center, so you have to frequently click on the fractal image and drag it around in order to recenter the area of interest. A much better way to explore is to point the mouse at the area that you're interested in and then double click to zoom in around the mouse or type I for the same effect. Whenever you double click, FX doubles the magnification and smoothly animates to the new location so that you can more easily keep track of where you're going. To zoom out, just double click with the right mouse button or type O. Or if you have a mouse wheel, then just spin it forwards to zoom in and of course spin it backwards to zoom out. You can spin it slowly or quite quickly, and it is actually the fastest way of exploring fractals in Fractal Extreme. Different parts of the Mandelbrot set have very different themes. If you zoom in around the spike on the right, then what you find is what looks like an infinite stream of elephants. If we zoom in on the black spike on the left, then we'll find a miniature copy of the Mandelbrot set. And if we go over to the right and zoom in further, we'll find another copy of the Mandelbrot set. And we can repeat this process indefinitely. It turns out that there's an infinite number of copies of the Mandelbrot set, all connected together by infinitely thin black lines. If we peel off, we will find some sort of bizarre and unique fractal landscape. And when zoomed in this far, it is extremely likely that no other person has ever visited this exact location. Now, we haven't found anything particularly beautiful or fascinating here, but let's pretend that this is our masterpiece that we decide we want to frame. We can perfectly crop it by holding down the shift key and click dragging up and down. There, that's just about perfect. To improve the quality, we can now turn on anti-aliasing and we've got ourselves a lovely image. You can also make a movie which shows exactly how this location is found from the unzoomed Mandelbrot set. It's very easy. Just go to the render menu and select Make Zoom Movie. You can change the name if desired or the starting zoom level, but all you have to do is click OK. FX will now render all of the keyframes needed to make an efficiently compressed movie that can be played back at high quality at virtually any speed and size. You can see that FX makes use of all of the available CPU cores. Now that the movie is finished, we can dynamically adjust the speed of playback and notice that it still plays back very smoothly, whether at very slow speeds or when we speed it up. When it's running at high speed, we can go all the way from the initial Mandelbrot set to fully zoomed in in a matter of seconds. That's it for our tour of Fractal Extreme Navigation. Give the demo a try, and thanks for watching.